Hi everyone, welcome to Miss Chinese Food. I'm Jack. Today we learn how to make Chinese pickle fish soup. It's very delicious pickle soup that rich in collagen. Let's start. Firstly, we should prepare ginger for this pickle fish soup. Cut six slices of ginger. Then save them for later. Second, we should prepare 100 gram pickle feet for this soup. When we buy them from the market, they will have some pickle hair not curling up. We can ask the salesperson to use the small fire to burn them. Then carefully scrape the pickle feet with a knife. Then use water to wash them. Then save them for later. Next, we should blend pickle feet. Firstly, add pickle feet. Three slices of ginger. One bunch of green onions into the pot. Then enough water to immerse them. Use high heat to boil them. After the water has boiled, blanch pickle feet for 3 minutes. We should scum the bubble when the water is boiling. Then drain and use water to wash them. Next, we should blanch 70 gram peanuts. Add enough water into the pot. Then use high heat to boil them. After the water has boiled, add peanuts into the pot to blanch for 5 minutes. After 5 minutes, drain and use water to wash them. Then save them for later. Now we can start to cook Chinese pickle feet soup. I pick a feet. Three slices of ginger, peanuts into the pot. Then 2000 ml water to immerse them. Then use high heat to boil them. After the water has boiled, use low heat to cook them for an hour and a half. When the soup is cooking, we should wash 10 gram goji berries for this soup. Immerse them for 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, Drain them and save them for later. After an hour and a half, 
a half teaspoon salt, one teaspoon white peppers into the pot. Stir them evenly. Add goji berries into the pot. Continue to cook it for five minutes. After five minutes, we got a delicious pig fish soup. The pig feet are nutritious and taste delicious. It's not only a common dish, but also a good tonic for our body. Okay, that's our Chinese food today. If you like our video, please subscribe or like us. If you have any problems, please leave your comment below. Thanks for watching. See you next Chinese food. Bye.